If you open any current history book or watch any mainstream documentaries that actually manages to cover this part of the Second World War, it will be impressed upon you that Heisenberg, the nuclear scientist, failed to deliver a nuclear bomb to the German Reich, either deliberately, a thesis he discreetly hinted at himself in latter years, or simply because he could not make it work. In his memoirs, Pash later notes that this uranium was used in the bomb dropped on Hiroshima. This begins to clarify why and how the Manhattan Project, despite its vast resources until then, still was low on uranium. Suddenly now managed to have enough stocks for multiple bombs. There was a great fear that Germans were on the cusp of deploying a nuclear weapon, and it was, of course, imperative to stop them. However, the suitcase's most shocking document revealed that Peterson had recently visited Hechenen, a town rumored to be a center for atomic research. Later, it was discovered that Germans actually had a lab there with an isotope separation unit, and in a nearby cave, an experimental pile. They found the elusive German nuclear program. It is looking more and more as if... It was not the Americans, but the Germans who won the race to create a ready-to-use nuclear weapon. When we incorporate the information, I will now present to you.